were starting out, I said to Raquel, there are three T's in entertainment. Talent, teeth, and tits. Now Raquel's only six, she'll be seven in November, so she's really only fully developed in the talent department, but she's doing her best with the rest. I show her, give the world a smile like they can't take their eyes off you, then thrust forth your bosom like a cockney songbird. <laughs> thrust. Make sure you show me that big smile, show me it now. Fabulous. Good girl. We want you to get this one, okay? This well, she's a bit too young to know Barbara Windsor from anything other than EastEnders, but I have shown her photographs of when those heels were alive with the sound of music, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, and it's adorable now. Before we, um, before we go into an audition, I'll say, Raquel! Call her to attention, like. And she just looks up at me and says, Teeth and tits, Mum. Teeth and tits. Lift. Please. Raquel! Raquel! Oh, here she is! My little Raquel. Hello, darling. You alright? Are you alright? Good. So, uh, what are you two up to at the moment, then? Well, um, they're changing casts in Les Mis. I mean, you can't imagine how hard I fought to get an audition in Les Mis. I mean, it would have been a little bit easier if she was signed to a better known theatrical agent, but I really feel that she is the kind of talent that won't get hidden under a bushel, so why throw away the extra 10%? Do you know what I mean? Nevertheless, for an old war horse like Les Mis, they really don't want someone like me ringing up demanding an audition, do they? <laughs> but I did. <laughs> and I coached her into poignant perfection. What don't you, what don't you sing? There is a castle on a cloud. Okay, that's great. I like to go there in my sleep. Nobody shouts or talks to... I mean, you know the show, and Raquel would be perfect for it. On my own, pretending he is beside me. All alone, I walk with him till morning. And I said to her, I don't want to see a dry seat in the house. Torch them, stick them with pins. And I gave her a Chinese burn and pushed her on stage. <laughs> she was spellbinding. Hairs on the back of my neck sticking up. I thought, Jeanneberg and Boo Boo have never been so thrillingly interpreted. Not since Michael Bull, anyway. And then I thought, Raquel has honestly, honestly got what it takes. You better shape up. Hello. Thanks for getting back to me. 